Hey guys, welcome to Mario 1. Now, there's t there's three reasons I'm playing this today. Uh, number one is it's uh, Mario's <coughs> 35th anniversary today. Uh, number two, uh, Extendo Fun said that level skipping or world skipping is for losers, which I am personally against, so I'm going to try and prove him wrong the best I can, and uh, the third and last reason is I, I need something to keep me up today, I didn't sleep last night, so let's, uh, let's get started, shall we? Okay, world 1-1. One, one. <sighs> Good old world 1-1. You know, I actually have a, quite of an interesting story, or backstory with Mario. See, back in 2013, I got my, I got a DS, which was my first, well, well, technically it was DSi. Uh, it was my first, uh, Nintendo thing, like, ever, that Uh, yeah, that was, it, it was fun, owning a DSi, I, I still have it actually, um, but I didn't play, I didn't have any Mario games actually, uh, I, I started getting to, into Mario, I had this like little Mario phase when 3D Land was still in the works, uh, but then I fell out of it for some reason, and I started hating Mario, because I was still, uh, like, an exclusively Sonic kind of guy, you know, so I was really stubborn, um, but, uh, ten years ago, I got an emulator, and I tried out the 2D Marios, and I didn't like them at first, but I did like World. I liked World. World is still one of my favorites. Um, but yeah, uh, the yeah, this is pretty much my history with Mario. I I liked it for a bit, or a bit when I was younger, and now I'm like a legit fan. So. Yeah, I'm really, I'm really excited for 3D All-Stars this Friday, that's gonna be fun. I can't wait to play Galaxy, you know, I beat 64 uh, the other day, but that was only because of um, me using some 16 star strats, so yeah, uh, I didn't, I didn't beat it fully technically, uh, so, but I, I really do enjoy what I played of 64, and I think it's a really charming game, it's not, it's not flawless, it's not flawless, but, you know, I, I think it definitely has its charm, and I think it's still a good game. Um, right now, I'm a good... Like, I, I think I'm almost done with Sunshine. I started playing it, I started playing it like, um, like, like a week ago, I think. Yeah. And, fuck! Uh, um, um, yeah, Sunshine, I was, it was the one Mario game I was indifferent to. Longest time, I had no idea what to think about it because I didn't play it that long because the gameplay wasn't that interesting to me. But I, I just I started I started uh, just just plowing through the gameplay, plowing through the levels. I dealt with it 
And now I really like the game. Yeah, I, I really I Oh, game over. Yeah, um, Sunshine, I like what I've played of it so far, it definitely has, okay, so it has parts, a lot of parts that, uh, do better things than 64 did, but it also has really bad clunky parts, but that's to be expected from an early 2000 platform. A 3D one, that is. But, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm really excited to, uh, try out Galaxy and see what that's like, because, uh, I haven't gotten to play it yet, and a lot of my friends, and just a lot of people online, have said that that Galaxy is their favorite 3D Mario, so I'm very intrigued to get 3D All-Stars this Friday and uh, try it out for myself, see what I think. You know, I find it pretty funny that uh, Nintendo is using the book of Mario 64 that is, uh, th that fixed the BLJ. I think that's funny. And also, no more, <laughs> no more gay Bowser. That's, that's unfortunate. Anyway, yeah, we're, we're about to do our first warp. So take that extendo. <laughs> okay. So, yeah. Um, where was I? Oh, yeah. So, my brain is farting. Um, oh, shit. Okay, so, uh, oh! it don't matter. Uh, I, I find it weird, I find it weird that, uh, 3D All-Stars just isn't gonna include, uh, Galaxy 2. Cause, it, like, if you're gonna include Galaxy, you might as well include Galaxy 2, you know? So you got the complete package. Cause, like, Galaxy 2 and 3D Land are, like, the only games, the only Mario's that aren't gonna be on the Switch, at least as it stands, which I think is really weird, but, you know, Nintendo is kind of a dick sometimes, so, oh fuck. <sighs> well, I, I think we're doing this fast extendo, so, that's all that matters, I, but, I, I, you know, I, I don't... actually know if he beat the game in his video, because I haven't watched the full video yet, but what he said, when he said that world skipping was for losers, you know what? You know what, Extendo? I don't need to prove to you that world skipping isn't cringe. Because you should already know. You are only a true Mario fan if you world skip in Mario 1. So fuck you. Fuck your strategy. I don't need to prove to you that world skipping isn't cringe because 
it's it's not. It's not. I I don't I don't know what you're talking about. So yeah, fuck you, Extendo. Fuck this. I'm out.